Hi everyone, so Petty Petta Ink Eddie Velvet has released 5 additional colors to their newest collection So if you guys aren't aware, I think they're trying to repackage the old Petty Petta Ink Eddie Velvet Because if you guys have watched my 1 to 5, it's exactly identical for me Formula wise, it's the same, even the payoff as well It's supposed to give you a smooth, weightless, vivid color payoff But also finding your MLBB shade as well So they've released 6 to 10 this is how the application is like you just apply a little bit it's great for gradation also fuller lip you can um, layer it as well but there's only so much you can layer and longevity lasts about five to six hours before it actually stain so let's get started on these swatches the first one is number six and for me i felt like this was like a strawberry red color that's how i describe it as you can see the way i smooth it out it does give you that really nice blur effect but also feel really lightweight on your lips and for me this one is a pretty color especially as a gradient because it really shows you the blur effect a lot it doesn't cling onto my dry patches but this particular shade stain the most because it actually gives you a dark pink payoff the next one is number seven which is orange red and again I mean I call this orange red color so it does have a really dark red undertone but also the payoff is like an orangey shade so it's a beautiful mixture of orange and red color together on me it leans towards much more of the red side but in real life you can really see that orange showing up on my lips now this one sort of matched the model I guess but as usual Petty Petta's true model doesn't really match to your lips you know now next number eight for me I call this more like a pink coral shade because I can see a hint of red undertone to it but also you can also see that it is very light color very cutesy and much more of a coral definitely a spring color for me now this one definitely do show some of my dry patches so definitely explore your lips when you apply this because it does look quite sheer at the same time number nine for me this is a sheer orange as well out of all the five number eight and number nine i noticed is the lightest in the collection so be aware if you do have dry lips because I would definitely recommend to exfoliate but as you can see it's a beautiful light shade color definitely really great for spring and I really like this a lot but I just need to exfoliate my lips last color I love 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 this shade because I thought this was really unique compared to the whole Petty Petta Eddie Ink Velvet collection this one for me I call this like a bubble bar Bubble, bum, bum, bubble gum pink but at the same time it looks very sweet doesn't look too fluorescent or vivid i've just felt like this was such a beautiful sweet color and i just i've worn this a few times now and i really like this but this one stained a lot too so overall these are all the colors out of all the five only number six and number ten stain the rest doesn't stain as much but i will be showing you guys a demo of how it looks like so obviously the longer you wear it the more stain it will get currently i'm still having like little bit of stain of number 10 on my lips while actually doing this voiceover so definitely be very careful when applying this but 7 to 9 doesn't really stain as much soon i'll be showing you guys like a comparison of what i thought was very similar to the old Petty Petta Eddie Ink collection so here are a quick snapshot of what i've done so the top are all the old one and the middle are all the new ones and the bottom are the similarities that i could find so i hope you guys enjoy this quick comparison and i'll come back to you guys for the ratings very soon So I hope you guys enjoyed the mini comparison so you can see that there are some similarities in this particular collection but overall I'm going to give the same ratings as my previous one because I still like all this Petty Petta Ink Every Velvet. The colors obviously doesn't really match to the model itself. Longevity does last about five to six hours because of the staining and I still think it's affordable even though it's much more lighter than the previous um, Petty Petta Ink Every Velvet collection. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!